Okay, so according to the New York Times, the number of confirmed cases increases by nearly 25% from 5,974 on Wednesday up from 4,550 on Tuesday, according to the National China's National Health Commission. Uh, but they believe that it could be much higher. So we're going to do a simulation on that based on that 25% increase day per day for 30 days and see where we get. All right, we're going to do a simulation. They said there's about 6,000 patients right now, and it increases by 25% a day. So we're going to multiply it by 125 for 30 days. So I won't bore you by, you know, multiplying it on the calculator. We'll speed it up. But this is what happens at the end of 30 days. 4,846,761 people infected, which means it'll be about 100,000 dead. And of course, the infection rate will probably be exponential, and it will grow faster than 25% per day. But I'm just extrapolating on the numbers that we've been given uh, from uh, the New York Times. Okay, now we're going to extrapolate for another 30 days. Times 1.25. All right. Times... Two days, three days, and I'm going to warn you right now, the numbers are very scary. 29, 30. At those infection rates, after 60 days, there would be 3,132,145,885 people infected, and there is a, a death rate of 0.02%, uh, which would bring it to over 62 million dead, making the coronavirus as bad as the 1918 Spanish flu that killed 50 to 100 million. Let's hope they can contain it and they can create a uh, vaccine to protect the rest of us. All right, if you like this video, subscribe to my channel and check out my other awesome videos.